This is Apollo Saturn Launch Control. We passed the six minute mark in our countdown for Apollo 11, the flight to land of the first men on the moon. We're on time at the present time for our plane liftoff of 32 minutes past the hour. Coming up shortly, that swing arm up at the spacecraft level will come back to its fully retracted position. We know it will be a good flight. Good luck and Godspeed. 11, 10, 9, ignition sequence start. I'm going to step off the land now. All steps for man. One giant leap for mankind. Today, I launched my new series, Go Street. The mission? Bring you along with me while I do street photography in all the major areas of Tokyo and beyond. And yes, after eight long years in Fukuoka, I've now moved to Tokyo to live and shoot in as much as I can. Today, I'm also shooting a film I've been saving for months. It's Lomachrome Metropolis Tokyo. I've never shot it before. I've only seen samples. So I wanted to make sure I can shoot it on a nice sunny day to test its exposure latitude and characteristics. Now, let's go street. I no longer have to rush when I visit here. I can take my time. Shibuya features arguably the most famous area in Tokyo. The scramble. A massive four-way intersection that's filled with cars one second and hundreds of people the next. And the best part? The people never stop coming 24-7. All types of people visit this part of the city. Workers, fashionable shoppers, families, characters, tourists, partiers, you name it, they all come here eventually. By the way, I'm only showing you about a quarter of Shibuya today. Shibuya is truly too massive for one video. So make sure to subscribe to my channel as I'll be showing you more of it and Greater Tokyo later too.
If you look hard enough here, past the bigger things, you can find some smaller, different elements to play with. Lighting here can be quite dynamic too, as it finds its way through the different sized buildings and structures. This area of Shibuya is called Center Guy. In the daytime, it's busy, but fairly tame. At night, it can get pretty wild though. Smaller side streets are in Shibuya too, giving you a chance to regroup mentally from the crowd. I couldn't capture anything worthwhile here. I know in the future I will though. Here too. Oh, but here? It took me a while, but I had fun here. The various intersections really are the key aspect of Shibuya. After a while, the people tend to blend into each other.
you could call it chaotic. However, when you're in it, time seems to slow down. Also slowly, people these days are showing their face more and becoming more friendly. So spotting the real gems in the sand is a rewarding endeavor. Nice. So, what did you all think of this film? Personally, I won't be using it so often. I enjoy more saturation and contrast. Also, let me know in the comments where in Tokyo you would like to see next. Stay humble, everyone. What did you think of today's music in the video? To be honest, I really loved it, and I'm so happy I could find something to fit the mood and atmosphere I was going for. Previously with my channel, I was struggling trying to find quote unquote free music online to fit my videos. I would spend hours searching for the right music, and then Often, the free music would get struck down by YouTube's copyright infringement overlords. Then I thought, why don't I make my own music? And I did for a while, but it quickly became too time consuming, and I couldn't find the time to make more and make good songs at that. I can't be a full-time photographer, YouTube superstar, dad punching bag, and competent music producer all at once. That's why I turned to Artlist, for all my music and sound effect needs. No matter the genre, mood, rhythm, or beat you're looking for, Artlist has you covered. They give you the license for every song, and it's yours to use forever in the projects you made, even if you decide to cancel your subscription later. I have a custom link in my video description for you to use. Also, anyone who purchases an Artlist annual subscription via my link will receive two additional months free. This will also help support my channel, so I think you should give it a shot, and we'll all benefit. Thanks Artlist, and thanks to everyone who subscribes today.